hurt it. Well, we're back at the belly blind. Not ideal condition, but we ain't been here in like a week. So hopefully, maybe letting them rest will pay some dividends. It's cloudy, little light breeze. I generally like to hunt it in the sun, but don't we all? Uh, but we'll see, I don't know. I take that as a pretty good sign. We got the skunk off, boys. Here he comes, Mr. Billy, get up. Oh, he dead. Oh, Laird, Laird, Laird center mass chest shot that one. He ain't, he ain't no cripple. Yeah, yeah, that's a bad deal for him. He just, he melted. I said, oh, buddy. He's gonna be dead when I find him. I powdered him right above us and then I moved on. He just exploded, so I said, I'm out. Let's go to these other ones. But I'm gonna look for him real quick. Y'all kill whatever comes in here. We're gonna be leaving about the time it clears off. Right Billy, right here, right here, right out front. You see him, Billy? I mean, he, he, he went ahead and sat her on down.
Well, that's a wrap. It, uh, I think we got 19. That's pretty good hunt considering the circumstances. Cloudy. Not much wind to start, and now it's done switch, and it's dead in our face, so there ain't no reason to sit here and pile up ducks. Go to the house, leave them for another day. We still got 30 something days left in this season, so. And it don't look like we're gonna get any new ones. So take care of the ducks you got. That's all I know to do. Let them be, come back when the conditions are right. So we're gonna wrap it up, get out of here, pick all this junk up, and go to the house. Call it good. It's a good shoot though. We got, we got us 19 of them. I'm happy with that. I'm sassy five. Tree. You want the tree or what's next? <laughs> well, it's slow. And I do mean slow. So, uh, we got a big rain coming, in theory. Uh, so when that happens, we hunt the reservoir. This should be a gadwall shoot. Won't be much calling. Won't be much anything. We're just going to sit here and watch them. And wherever they start going, we're going to walk to them. So hopefully they'll be pretty close to right here. But uh, but with that rain coming, what it does, it raises the water level in here. And when it does that, it also puts fresh water out in the field. So uh, when the water comes up in here, the gadwalls can't get to the coontail. So before big rains, we generally like to shoot this spot uh, just, just because. And then once the rainwater dries up, they'll come back in here and we can hunt it again. But uh, we shall see. It's a it's a good south wind today, and supposedly the rain gonna start by nine. So hopefully, with the good Lord on our side, we'll uh, we'll have a we'll be out of here by the time rain starts. But we'll see. We on the board. We had to let them know whose team we's on. I get this one. Walls are doing in this reservoir. This thing's fighting. There's a piece right there. Come here. Where'd you go? Oh man, I'm trying not to get my whole sleeve wet. Hold on. Let me pick up some gadwall food. Right there. That's why they're in here. Coontail. So this coontail will have, they eat the grass, but what you don't see is all the little invertebrates that'll be in it. So like freshwater shrimp, little snails, all that kind of mess. Uh, and that's what them gadwalls are in here eating. So uh, that's why they love this place and that's why we manage it, to grow as much coontail as possible. So during the summer, we'll spray for hyacinth, spray the uh, the water lotus and, and give that coontail plenty of sunlight so that it can germinate and during the winter, we'll draw it down. And when you draw it down, it just makes it easier for the gadwalls to get to the food. So, um, you know, it's just part of gadwall 
if you got a spot that fills up with gadwalls traditionally, generally this is why. So if you start actively managing, then you can, you can, uh, you know, you can shoot gadwalls most of the year. But been a good hunt. I mean, I think we we all need one more, I believe. So uh, been a great hunt. And you can come this time of year on this year especially. Look, this year is crazy. First split, fantastic. And we ain't got no new ducks since. So we hunting the same old ducks. And if you can come out here now and kill 15, that's pretty, pretty doggone good duck hunting. So uh, we'll take it. We're gonna get a big rain tomorrow. Uh, so that'll run them out of here. And we'll just try to manage it best we can. We'll probably go hunt a field or something tomorrow in the rain. But, um, you know, it is what it is. We still got like 30 days left. That's hard to figure. But. We're about to check it to them. I think Clay gonna go get the boat. So we'll go pick the ground up the rest of our ducks and call it good.